Hello friend, welcome back. In this video, I will show you how can manage your reviews from your store. Like if you go to your category page and in the category page, we already upload some of the product on here. There is a t-shirt. So now open this t-shirt. Now you can see there is a review is none and there is a zero reviews. So for now, if you are any customer review to this product, then he, there is actually the review option and in the review option, there is the write the review. By default, there is the name because of we already logged in. You can see there is we are already logged in in this shop. For the reasons is automatically added the name. So there is a Kaziarian. For now, I'm just adding some of the review for education purpose for this product, like this t-shirt, like this t-shirt is very good. Okay, or any kinds of things. If you want to put some of the reviews on here, then you can put that review a specific this product. Okay, and there is the rating. But now I'm just adding the good rating for this product. Okay, so that is the review. So that is the rating. And now I just add as a complete. And you can see that thank you for your review. It has been submitted to Webmaster for approval. So that's the things. Actually, you have to make that things from the back end option area. So if you have any customer put some of the review for to your product, then if you want to manage this review, then you have to go to your dashboard area. And in the dashboard area, there is a catalog. And in the catalog, you can find out that there is a reviews. So click on the reviews and here is your all the review list and you can see there is a man's t-shirt one so that is actually the man's t-shirt one so there's the review product name and there is the author there is a kaziarian and the rating is five and there is a status is now disabled okay so now if you click on the edit and now there is the author name that is the product that is the text that the, your customer actually gives to you in your store and there is a rating and there is a date okay so now if you like there is the already you post some of the review for a specific this product now if you refresh this page and here you can see there is a review is still now on zero because you have to actually approve this review so for now i'm just making that things as a enable and now save this page and if you now refresh this page again now you can see your review is already added on here they have one reviews and the five is the rating i hope you can understand about it and you can also visible that things on here there is the one review so if you select on the one review, you can find out the Kaziari and there is the t-shirt is very good and there is a five rating. Okay, so now it's actually visible on your product page. So you can also set up that things in your setting option. And when I discuss about the setting option, then I will show you how you can manage that review option. Like for now, we have to approval it manually. So if you want to make that things is automatically, then you can actually set up that things from the setting option. So when I discuss about the setting, then it should be very much clear to you. So all the reviews, first of all, is comes to this review list and then you just choose it and then you can actually enable it manually. So I hope you can well understand about it, the how you can manage your reviews from your store. So that's your free views. In our next video, I will discuss about the information. So how you can manage your information page from your store. I will show you with the live example. So thank you for watching this video. Keep learning.